Hey, what's going on, guys? We are back. Part 2 of what seems to be episode 8. This chapter is very, very long, guys. It is very, very long. Uh, this is a very, very long chapter. Um, so, yeah, we are on chapter 8. I started, I think, we, yeah, we started chapter 8 on episode 7. Then we went through an hour on episode 8. And we're still on chapter 8. So now, this is part 2 of chapter 8, of episode 8. So this this chapter is over an hour long. And this is an Iron Man match. So you gotta score more points than Candace. She's in control. It's starting to come together in a big way. She's got the skill and the stamina to really do some damage here. Backslide driver! You know what they call that? Something no one would ever do to me. Oh yeah. Oh, nice. What a stop to the back of the neck. A running swanton. And the world is really going at it with Candace. Not wasting any time. Uh, get yourself up, Candace. Get inside, Candace. Get inside the ring. Get inside the ring, Candace. She's talking about not wanting to be an embarrassment to Johnny. She should be more concerned with Johnny being Oh no, he countered. Why did you have to counter, Candace? Alright, Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, calm down, calm down, Candace. Alright, calm down, Candace. This is one of your college parties. Because I'm winning this match. I don't care what it takes, I'm winning this match. What the hell was that? I don't care what you have to do, okay? I am winning this match, Candace. Alright, that is a guarantee, that is a promise. That is a promise. I am winning this match. Not you, me. Alright, go for a pair. Maybe that could be it. Maybe that could be it for the first for the first one, for the first point. That's the first point. Ah, oh, the rope break! Dang it! Oh, I hate the rope break. That's why I always like to have the rope breaks off. But I don't think you can put them off in universe mode. Or not universe mode, but my career mode. But that's the reason why I like rope breaks off. A lot of the times it costs me in matches. I got my finisher back up now. Not pinning yet though, not gonna pin here. We gotta get our finisher back up. Damn. She's got her. Boom. Yeah. Wrenches the arm. Drop kick. Beautiful. Oh, 
Get back in the ring, Candace. Get back in the ring, Candace. Get yourself back in the ring. And that's what happens when you underestimate me. One. Now this cannot be a rope break. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's not gonna be it though. A signature ended it, but not a finisher. Now I got two points. Candace rolls out of the ring. Uh, head scissors. Round and round we go. Boom. Nice. That beautiful head scissors. What you got, Candace, huh? Huh, Candace? Huh, Candace? Huh, Candace? Right Woo! Beautiful super kick. Tries again. Ah, oh, she so counted that one. Yeah, she's over, she's done now. She's done now. She's done now. Oh, she is done now. It is four to zero. The champion is in serious jeopardy here tonight. I don't think I've ever seen a more determined challenger. Changes her fortune there. Oh gosh, she caught me. Oh, I can't counter this time. I can't counter this one. That was the only way to escape that. That was the only way to escape that. Guys, you gotta be smart. You gotta use your brain. You know, if you can't counter anything, use your possum. If you have that thing on your character where you can't counter, for a minute or whatever. Use that possum, because look what happened. I was able to get out of it, still. Job part of being smarter than the game.
We're gonna do it over here. That was not what I was looking for. That's not even what I did. First of all, that, that's the fir that's the first thing I have to go over. There we go. Yeah, a pin, pin, pin. One, two, three, one. She's not even using her resiliency. Oh, she counted that. She counted that. I already won this match, though. There's no way that she's going to get six points to beat me in three minutes. No way of that happening. Unless I just let her pin me three times. Or oh, six times. You done, Candace. That's the other thing I gotta do too. Now that she has springboard diver and stuff and top rope, well not top rope, but springboard diver and stuff like that. I mean she has top rope diver, but now that I unlock springboard diver for her character, um, I need to apply some springboard moves. Cause she is a high flyer, so she's supposed to have those. So now I gotta apply those to her moveset. I keep forgetting to do it. Nope. Nope. And you are going back outside the ring. Woo! The barrel row. And she just went flying. She went flying. She ain't winning this thing. She's done with. She is done with. We're gonna see if we can actually pin her with this. I didn't think so. We can get one more on her though. We actually can get one more on her. Except we want to go this way. Oh gosh. You were supposed to be stunned. You were supposed to be stunned. You were supposed to be stunned. We got one more on her. We got six to zero. Six to zero. I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. Oh gosh. Ow. Ow. Nope. Ow. Look, I want to be the last one standing. What are you doing? It's locked in now. She better do something fast. No, she escapes it. Yeah! Last one standing too, right at the end there. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. All right.
So now we are on Superstar. Nice. So it looks like uh, we unlock hands, nails, we unlock the we unlock the mask, our mask, we unlocked Velveteen Dream, my career, we unlocked uh, his outfit, we unlocked the Dream Over shorts, we unlocked some more wrestling tights, we unlocked the Trey and Dream wrestling tights, and yeah, we unlocked those two masks. I like those masks. And the hands, nice. Awesome. We are on Superstar now, guys. We are on Superstar now. Alright. And guys, that is going to be it for this one. Because uh, Part 2 is just finishing up Chapter 8. So that is going to be it for this one. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like for future content videos. And I will see you all in the next one. Which will be Episode 9. Thank you guys, and see you next time. So, I'm not really going to talk about my time in NXT. Overall, it was great, but I don't want to give Rhea Ripley the attention after what she did. She could have ended my career before it even started. I still think you should have changed your name to Red Eye after that. Think of the marketing opportunities for airlines and allergy medicine that would have come your way. You left a lot of money on the table. Can you focus on our speech instead of bringing up bad ideas from the past? Bad ideas? There's another tie-in you missed out on. Please come in and save me from my idiot best friend. Hey, soon-to-be Hall of Famers. It's my old tag partner. That didn't last very long, did it? Unfortunately, no. I just wanted to say that I am so excited and honored to induct you tonight. We wouldn't want anyone else to do it. I mean, Undertaker would have been pretty cool. Or President Rock. He actually texted us today. Check it out. Can you please stop insulting Rhonda before she snaps your arm off? It's fine. Now I can't find the text. Please tell me I didn't accidentally delete it. Rhonda's the perfect person to induct us. She and I had some intense battles when I first got into WWE. Especially that Money in the Bank match with the arm bar on top of the ladder. I am definitely going to mention that tonight. And I have to tell that story about Trey's first night on Raw. That was crazy. Do you think messages from the president self-destruct, like for security reasons? I don't know about that. Oh, I almost forgot. This was on your door. See you out there soon. What is it? No, from my parents. You haven't talked to them in years. No, my real parents. It says they're going to be at the Hall of Fame ceremony tonight. Wow, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it either. Between never hearing from them again after they sent me that letter in high school and then all those times I left tickets for them and they didn't show, I, I'd given up hope. But now I'm finally going to meet my actual real parents. This is so cool. Are you sure it's not some kind of misunderstanding? It has to be them. Look, they signed it the same way they signed the letter I got in high school. This really isn't the best time, but maybe we should talk about this whole thing with your birth parents. No, you can't do this. What's there to talk about? They must have finally seen me on TV and tracked me down, which is all thanks to you. You're the one who encouraged my big debut on Raw, remember? 